YouTube. You're watching Chef Adventures. I'm Chef Jason. Thanks for being with us. Today, I want to share with you an incredible drink you can make at your Halloween parties this year. The Drunken Pumpkin Pie Shot. Let's get started. The whipping up delicious dishes. It must be the Chef Adventures. Chef Adventures. Welcome back. Let's talk about preparing the pumpkin. Um, here on my pumpkin, you see I have what's called a melon tapper. Melon tappers can be purchased online. They can be bought in home stores. I used this melon tapper on a past project this last summer called Watermelon Keg. It worked fantastic. And they also comply and work well with pumpkins. So we're going to be making our drink inside the pumpkin, serving it from our tapper. If you don't have a tapper, not a big deal. Simply still carve out your pumpkin, make your drink inside, ladle and serve your drinks right from the pumpkin. It's not a big deal, still super fun, super, super great. So let's get into our ingredients. The ingredients required to create the drunken pumpkin pie shot, a fun Halloween pumpkin keg recipe include Baron Jaeger, butterscotch schnapps, pumpkin pie creamer, vanilla extract, Pumpkin pie spice extract. This is seasonal. It's in the stores right now, easy to find. We're gonna garnish our shots with a little whipped cream and cinnamon. So let's get started. But before we continue, this is a hashtag drink tips collaboration. Hashtag drink tips is a collaboration with fellow YouTubers to create drinks to share with you. Check out our friends at Just Ate, Ryan G's Barbecue and Stuff, Jamie Mack, and the Silly Kitchen with Sylvia. Their incredible content you can find below in the hashtag drink tips and their links to their channels will be in our description below. Check them out, subscribe, great content, and I can't wait to see your drink videos either. So let's make a drink. We're gonna put ice in our pumpkin. I have three large ice cubes. Um, you don't wanna fill this up too much. You don't wanna water it down. So three of these larger ice cubes is perfect. In a four cup Pyrex measuring glass, we're going to add a cup and a half Baron Jaeger. <laughs> Beautiful. Perfect. We're going to add two cups butterscotch schnapps. Woo, fill her up. One cup, Ooh, two cups. So now we are at three and a half cups total. We're gonna add half a cup pumpkin spice creamer. Beautiful, ooh, that's nice. All right, now this stuff's really potent. So we're gonna just add a dash of vanilla and a dash of the pumpkin spice extracts. We're gonna stir it and we're gonna taste it and see if we need to add more. Okay, so just a dash. That's good. That's the vanilla, just a dash of pumpkin spice. Ooh, that's it. Let's give this a stir. It looks beautiful. Fantastic. Drunken pumpkin pie shots coming your way. Now let's taste it. That's nice! Perfect. Now, we're gonna pour the rest of this into our pumpkin. It's gonna fill it up pretty close, pretty close, and we're gonna let it chill for a minute. Um, the pumpkin itself is also going to extract some of its own natural flavors to our mixed drink as well. So let's go ahead and pour it in. Okay, get that out of our way, give it a little stir, it smells so good, it smells like pumpkin pie, oh it's beautiful, um, the Baron Jaeger is a German liquor, kind of maintaining our um, Oktoberfest theme this month, which just, uh, just complements the butterscotch schnapps and the vanillas, um, that it's, it's beautiful, wow, alright. We're gonna put our cap back on and um, 
and we'll be back. Okay, everybody, we have now taken our drunken pumpkin pie shots. We've let it chill for about 10 minutes. It's beautiful right now. A fun Halloween pumpkin keg that you can make at your Halloween parties, events, and gatherings. Um, I want to take one second quick to thank our subscribers. Um, if you are watching and you enjoy what you see, go ahead, smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, leave us some comments below, let me know what you think about the drunken pumpkin pie shots, and I think let's go ahead, let's finish this drink. We're going to pour it, garnish it, and give it a taste. Here we go. Comes out beautiful. Loving it. Let's go ahead and do two of these. I know one's just not enough. <laughs> oh, it comes out so smooth. So, how do we garnish this now? Well, we're gonna use our whipped cream. Because what's pumpkin pie without whipped cream topping, right? <laughs> Serious. Nice. Beautiful. And we're going to hit it up with a small dash of cinnamon on top. Aw, oh, man. Pumpkin pie shots for the whole party will love. All right, here it goes down the hatch. Cheers to you guys. Wow. That's incredible. Perfect. Woo. Got a little bit of kick. Got that beautiful pumpkin pie flavor rolling through. So smooth. I can taste the natural pumpkin that's been infused in it. This is amazing. I, I can't stop at one. Gotta go for two. You guys have a great night. Cheers. Peace.